I'll hear with Tatum Backmeyer and Brooklyn Mans after Elmwood Murdoch gets a state quarterfinal win. Uh, ladies, I know you've been here a couple times to get over the hump and into the semifinals. How does that feel, Tatum? Oh, it feels great. You know, after four years of coming here, it feels good to win one finally. <laughs> Brooklyn, your thoughts? Yeah, it's just really fun to play with everybody and get a win. Looked like early on you guys were comfortable. Uh, talk about the fast start. Um, well, one of our goals, I think, is always just to get out and attack right away. So that's just what we did. Brooklyn, your thoughts on the fast start? I know you hit a big three early in the first. I think everyone was just really confident at the start, which helped us get momentum and keep going. So. Offensively, you guys led the way. Uh, Tatum, we'll start with you. Tell me about your role offensively tonight and what you were able to do to create success. Um, you know, I just we just kept moving the ball around, and even if we were going to turn the ball over a little bit because of the pressure, but we just knew we kept having to play through it and just keep pushing through. So, hey, Brooklyn, speak to your role offensively. Um, I would say I'm a shooter, and if I if my shots aren't falling, I like to try to find the open person and be a facilitator. This was kind of a defensive-minded game. Uh, you know, thoughts on the defense tonight? Um, we did well. We switched back from man and zone, so I think we just really needed to focus on getting out to shooters. Oakland Craig has a lot of good shooters, and that's what we did. So, Yeah, I would just agree with that. Looking ahead to Friday, uh, I mean, what, what's it going to take to take that next step? I think we're going to have to rebound really well. Clark, or Crofton's a physical team, so I think if we just continue to do that and play our game, we'll be just fine. All right, Coach, I uh, know you've been on the other side of it a couple times now to be on this side after the first day. How does that feel? You know, any win down here that you can get, no matter how you get it, it's a, a great feeling. Uh, I was really happy the second half we adjusted a little bit, went to that 2-3 zone, tried to keep it from the, from, the, uh, from the lane. I thought we did a nice job of that, and I thought we rebounded the ball real well. Late second, early third, you guys hit kind of a cold spell offensively, and then you end the third on a 10-0 run. Uh, what changed offensively? Well, that stretch right there, you got to give Oakland Craig. They, they get up and press you, and they take a lot of stuff away. Their run and jump, their double team really bothered us. Uh, once we broke pressure, we were able to kind of get some looks. Uh, we had better ball movement during that little bit of stretch. We were able to get to the rim a little bit, and that was a big difference. I know when I talked to you earlier this week, you mentioned the guard play was going to be big, and, and tonight with Tatum and Brooklyn, it sure felt like it was. Yeah, it was. Uh, those two really came up big, hit some big shots for us. Uh, got a couple steals. I thought they rebounded real well from the guard position, especially on the defensive end there. So um, they're always going to play well. You know, Tatum or Laney Fromm's got a bad a little bit of the cramp situation. Kind of affected her a little bit. But, uh, yeah, the guard play was a big difference. And that was what I was happy with. Down the stretch to hold on and win a game like this, what do you feel like you guys did well to make that happen? Well, we took, care, but we took a lot better care of the ball. Um, late in the game, and that, that's what it came down to. Uh, you got to give yourself a chance in the half court to either get to the free throw line or be able to knock down shots or get to get to the rim, and uh, that was a big difference, I thought, there in the, the second, uh, late in the fourth quarter. Looking ahead to Friday, you know, obviously a really good Crofton team, but anybody at this point is going to be good. What, what are the thoughts? Yeah, Crofton's uh, going to be a similar type team. They've got a lot of size inside. Uh, we're going to really have to rebound well. We're going to have to make sure uh, we'll be able to handle the pressure a little bit better than we did tonight. 